First, it takes a carjacking along Magazine Street, all caught on surveillance. Well, the victim is a beloved deli owner, and the crime happened right in front of his shop. WDSC reporter Elizabeth Kubel spoke to Stein's Market and Deli's owner about his terrifying night. Elizabeth. Yeah, and Dan Stein now has some pretty deep cuts and stitches after such a frightening attack, and all of it was captured on camera. Surveillance video from Stein's Market and Delhi shows the terrifying crime that unfolded right outside. Around 12.45 a.m. Thursday, Dan Stein leaves his store, gets in his blue Toyota 4Runner on magazine, and shuts the door. Just seconds later, another vehicle pulls up beside him. Stein describes the carjacking and beating that followed. Next thing I know, uh, I got four guys, like kind of two guys jumped out and brandished what I thought were weapons and then uh, told me to get out the car and then I uh, exited the car and did what they told me to get back, kept walking and then I think one of them hit me. I don't know if he hit me with the fist or hit me with a weapon. I don't know. Less than 12 hours later, Stein was already back at work and after a trip to the hospital that has now left him with stitches and a bandage above his eye. You know, I think a couple times it crossed my mind that you know, this is potentially a life-threatening situation, but it was happening so fast that I just kind of did what they did, told me to do. Another nearby Magazine Street business owner reacts to the attack that happened just two doors down. I was really upset about that, and it's something that I didn't think happened right here. It's never happened before. Back at Stein's, the owner says he's really feeling surprisingly okay, all things considered, and now has a message to be even more aware. 16 years, you know, walk out this deli late at night and nothing's ever happened to me. I stay in here, nothing's ever happened to me, and, you know, first time. And, but that's, that's probably the message is, you know, be careful. And the men got away in Stein's forerunner as well as the car they were originally in. Meantime tonight, police are still investigating this carjacking and asking anyone who may know anything to call Crime Stoppers. Reporting live on Magazine, I'm Elizabeth Kubel, WDSU News.